Welcome to this week's edition of the Planet Cancer Press. It's Friday, July 10th, and we have got an extremely busy day today. We're going to the LAF headquarters to watch Lance ride in the Tour de France. Go Lance! And we've got conference call after conference call, most of them talking about this year's launch of the Advocacy Roadshow. Heidi and I are going to be traveling around the country, presenting at Grand Rounds, speaking with doctors, who need to know about the young adult experience. They need to know the science and the psychosocial issues behind young adult cancer. So if you've got a contact, if your doctor's at a major comprehensive cancer care center, let us know, put us in touch, see if you can help us get in the door. Email us, contact us at planetcancer.org. Tell us what's up. We're Tom's new home. <laughs> Otherwise known as the Lance Armstrong Foundation. We're here for a, uh, a tour watching party. We've got the tour up on the big screen, so there's Lance Armstrong. Woo! Lance, who is our host here at the Lance Armstrong Foundation. Uh, so Tom, tell us about life here, now that you've abandoned us in Planet Cancer. Well, first of all, I want to point out that this is what happens when we Planet Cancer. You don't cross them. Karma so, the bitch! Second, second day on the new job, fell off the bike, broke my left hand three places. Ow! And that's what I get. The voodoo dolls worked, Courtney. <laughs> That was apparently a small price to pay, because I heard <laughs> what could have what could have happened. <laughs> Secondly, I want to point out a little known fact. Everyone knows Chairman of the Board is riding in the race today, Lance Armstrong. Christina Weiss, also in the pack, a little further back. I think she's riding about 150 right now. A little known fact. Also Chairman of the Board of Planet she's Cancer. She's a contender. She is, absolutely. <laughs> and the Schleck brothers, I believe, are sponsored by Planet Cancer. Yeah, They're yeah. riding Team Planet Cancer yeah. this year. Yeah. Little known fact. People don't know this. Yeah. Courtney has just made an amazing discovery in our tour watching party. Somehow cycling has escaped my domain as a sport, but I just found out that there's a polka dot jersey that's white with red polka dots. I look smashing in red polka dots. I should have taken up cycling years ago. It's a travesty, really. Tom, take us on a little mini tour of the Lance Armstrong Foundation headquarters. So these are the new offices, which is a converted uh, paper factory that got a lead rating of gold, which means it's like one of the, it's a very green friendly building. Mm. So even the carpet has all been glued down, individual patches with yeah, like environmentally safe glue or something, I don't understand the process, but it's very safe, it's very yeah. green. Uh, and all the wood you see is reused floorboards and ceiling boards that make the conference rooms. And everyone sits at just a drum little desk, including the, the CFO, CEO, Head of HR, everybody's just at their own little desk, and we're all on the same floor, so to speak. The lights dim with uh, with the, the waning and waxing sunlight. So that's another green thing. Sweet. Uh, nice open space. Your My Planet traffic report. Pretty busy online today. I like that we're discussing about how chemo totally screws up your skin. Another thing online, if you are between the ages of 25 and 40 and you've not yet applied to the retreat in August, do it now. Get your applications in online. You can see it on my planet or at planetcancer.org. Send in your application so you can come join us in August for the retreat. Here at the LAF headquarters, I'm chatting with Kelly Craddock. She is the woman behind the magic of the Live Strong Young Adult Alliance group. Hi, Courtney. Yes, we are here. Very exciting time at the LAF with the tour going on. Everybody's watching it, having a good time. I'm here helping get ready for the conference that goes on in November here in Austin. It's for um, all the Young Adult Alliance members like Planet Cancer. And we all do a lot of work to help you all you adolescent and young adults with cancer. So we're keeping up the work. That's it for this week's Planet Cancer Press. I gotta go get on a conference call. Bye.